This video is how to set up a spec tennis court on a regular tennis court. The first thing I'll need to do is measure the distance from the tennis net to the back fence to determine the space needed behind each baseline. In this case, I'm having seven and a half feet behind each baseline, so I make my first tape mark seven and a half feet from the net. I then use a tape measure to measure 44 feet from my tape mark and I'll tape alongside the tape measure using blue tape. Now it's important when you use the blue tape to walk on it after you've taped to make sure it's secure to the court surface. From there I'll go 20 feet across the width of the court to make one baseline and I'll tape that as well. From that baseline I go 44 feet back towards the fence to make my other sideline. Notice I set my spec tennis court up in the same direction as the regular tennis court. This is because the fence and the tennis net make good backstops and it's easier to contain the balls. And then another 20 feet across the width of the court connecting all the tape lines. This is my other baseline. Now I have the outline of the court. I'm going to find the halfway point of the baseline, so 10 feet in from one end. This will be my center line. Next, I'll set up my quick start net. This is an 18 foot net, and it is very common in uh, 10 and under tennis. It takes me about two to three minutes to set this net up. And finally, I want to make sure my net is centered on the court. So I'll do one more measurement. From the end of the sideline, I'll measure 22 feet towards the fence to find the halfway point. And then I'll adjust my net so it's in line with the center. Just like a 